Mammoth broke free easily. The Yagal tried to pull the fleeing Mammoth with their manpower, but their strength was simply too small in front of the Mammoth. Everyone chose to let go at this point. Kadara's hand was entangled in the rope and could not get out, so he was dragged by the Mammoth all the way to the top of the mountain, and finally the rope net hit a rock and broke. The Mammoth turned back toward Deer, but he managed to dodge it. Deer hurriedly picked up the spear and threw it, but the Mammoth's skin was so thick that the spear didn't do much damage to it. Deer picked up another spear to defend himself, but in his panic, he got it stuck in a crack in the stone. When the mammoth attacks Deer again, it actually slammed into the spearhead by itself, and Deer killed the mammoth leader by mistake, and he was awarded the highest honor of the Yakal tribe, and also married Evelyn, the most beautiful woman in the tribe. But the good life is always so short. This day, a group of marauders rode to the tribe. They had advanced weapons and armor, and burned and plundered Deer's tribe. But they only robbed and did not kill. They took all the young strong men and beautiful women of the tribe. Deer's recently married wife, Evelyn, was not immune.